this is the side of the house and the shed and my washing. So I'm building a Hegel culture bed here. Um, I dug up the rocks from the top of the garden where the conifer is. It was like a little border because this was all grass when I came a year a year ago. Yeah. So no, it's not <laughs> at all. <laughs> so I'm doing a hoogle culture here, and that's just trimmings. There's a big pile of brash at the bottom that I'm going to chip um, into wood chips. I got a shredder free from my uh, group, the Scab Free Community. Somebody kindly gave me a shredder so I can make wood chip. So this is going to be um, sort of shrubs and larger plants. So I've got a buddleia there and hydrangea that was given to me that I kind of want to keep even though it's not edible but never mind and then I've got um, various black currants, red currants, gooseberries, things like that that will also go in that bed and then I've got uh, this little tiny bed next to it which um, has just got some little bits of flowers in because this is the drive so the car backs up to there so I don't want to put anything too precious that won't like being covered in exhaust fumes so I've got some dead nettle I'm not sure what that is some kind of bulb and then I've got some primulas I did have some other things but they seem to have died back I've got quite a lot of self heal somewhere so I might put some of that there maybe some bluebells okay so that's that little corner I've got my chicken sheds waiting for chickens that haven't arrived yet but they will soon one day 